Happiness, money, they come, they go. But fulfillment, true fulfillment, that is what lasts you for a lifetime. Marketing that cuts through the clutter. We're talking about gate 58, which is the fulfilled. Now the low frequency of this gate is your happiness being as a result of other people. It's really ego based and it can feel great in the moment, but it's not long lasting. Now the high frequency of this gate is about deep fulfillment. It's about doing work and being of service and it lasts. When it comes to your marketing, this is about inspiring your audience by showcasing your story of going from potentially focusing on external measures of happiness, like money, which let's face it, happiness, money, they come, they go. But fulfillment, true fulfillment, that is what lasts you for a lifetime. It's your stories of how you've built more fulfillment in your life that are going to inspire your future clients. It's an interesting one talking about gate 58, the fulfilled when it comes to content. Because I know that some of you are down tools and potentially not creating content right now, but there are others of you who use this time of year to really dig into their creativity. Whatever the case, we're all likely thinking about the year ahead. And so with this energy of joy, vitality and fulfillment that we experience in the run up to the new year, let's explore some content that will absolutely resonate right now. Well, firstly, you want to be inspiring your audience to be thinking about fulfillment as a priority when it comes to their goals and ambitions for the year ahead. That feeling of fulfillment, particularly if you're a generator or a manifesting generator, is what keeps you going. It's more persistent than the moments of joy and it is absolutely something that we are responsible for creating in our own lives. So when we encourage others in our content to approach their goal setting with fulfillment in mind, it's going to shift them. It's going to take them to a place of sustainable success versus racing against goals and potentially tipping into frustration, scarcity, any of those low frequency energies. This is your responsibility in your content to have your audience excited to be thinking about what really fulfills me and how can I bring more fulfillment into my life in the year to come. What beautiful frequency to consider when it comes to things like New Year's resolutions, or indeed planning out those big, beautiful goals that you're intending to create in the year ahead. Another type of content that works really well in this energy is sharing what brings you fulfillment. Think about this as more like edutainment. You're taking your audience behind the scenes of what they don't usually see. It's a different energy at this time of year and they're gonna be more open to seeing what brings up these feelings for you and inspired by that content. It is also a great time to share the happiest moment of your life. When you felt the most joy in your heart, tell the story, get specific, take them into the details and this will build a beautiful connection. And a final content prompt for Gate 58, The Fulfilled, is about increasing the amount of fulfillment and therefore energy in your life. Because when you're in this place of fulfillment, you feel better, you feel more lit up, and then you feel like you actually have more hours in the day. I cannot tell you the difference between when I was working in corporate when I wasn't fulfilled, when I was chained to my desk or entertaining clients and in this, oh, this is heavy and this is draining vibe. This was a very different me. Time went quickly. 
now I'm so blessed to have created a life through my business where I live on the water, I work the hours that suit me and my energy. I have an incredible camper van that I can work from on the road. It is such a different life and it's available to anyone when they focus on fulfillment instead of ticking arbitrary success goals. And while we're here together at this time of year, I also want to take a moment to say thank you for joining us on this channel and to wish you the very best new year. I will be with you sharing this transits magic every six days all through the year ahead and cannot wait to help you create more resonant, more relevant and high frequency marketing. Wrapping up gate 58, the fulfilled. This one's about the lesson of external measures of happiness. Maybe you're thinking about money being the measure of success, never ever being a patch on the true measure of success, which is lasting and its fulfillment.